Hello there gorgeous gamers and welcome back to Pure Play TV and we've got a review for Stuffed, a first person wave shooter that has taken me by surprise because it's actually really good and I can't believe I've gone this long without knowing about it. If you've also been living under a rock, watch on and find out what we've been missing out on. Call of Duty Zombies but you play as a bear and the zombies are different toys. That's the game, that's Stuffed and it shouldn't be as good as it is. I downloaded my copy and booted it up not expecting much and even after a minute of play I had that sinking feeling that comes whenever I realise I've got to play and review a shit game. But a bit of tweaking with the controls, a bit of time spent letting the game show me what it's about and I was hooked. 10 waves in, protecting my precious Ellie's bedroom from the garden gnomes, wind up robots, shadow minions and more. And the funny thing is, I've only really experienced one side of the game, the single player. Stuffed is designed with co-op play in mind, but it's completely playable offline single player, which is how I played because I couldn't find any games online. I would have liked to have played it with the Pure Play TV child labour, Charlie, but sadly there's no split screen option and it's also not a play anywhere game, meaning if I want to play it on PC and do cross play with Charlie, I'll have to pay for the Steam version separately, which is not something Charlie and I are used to. We've played hours of Minecraft and Orcs Must Die 3 using cross play and play anywhere without paying any extra, so that's something to keep in mind if you want to play local co-op in a fashion. That little cheapskate gripe aside, I still had a great time playing single player, and Charlie and I would pass the pad back and forth to see who could survive the longest, so we made it work, and if the game was any lesser, we wouldn't have bothered. Stuffed has a simple concept, you must defend the bedroom door of a little girl, you're her protector, her big bad teddy bear, and you've got the gun foo skills to protect her from the baddies that want to bust in. It's all taking place in the little girl's dreams if you need an explanation. When I said it's like Call of Duty Zombies, it really is, in that you gain points for kills, which can be spent on unlocking new areas in the map, which leads to better weapons, pickups and portals that take you back to Ellie's door so you can fend off any attackers quickly. After 10 rounds, if you survived, the map randomly changes and the game essentially starts again from round 1, but everything is in a different place. Enemies are harder to kill and the challenge is ramped up and continues in this manner with each passing night. And that's all there is to it. You play, you fight, you die, you try and do a little better next time around. I imagine that with friends it's much more fun with the communication side of the game, planning and plotting on how best to defeat the incoming hordes, but that side of the game is sadly out of reach, at least until Pocket Money Day. My only real annoyance with the game is in the game's aiming controls. I've managed to get it to a point where it feels okay, but I just can't get it feeling right. It's not a massive issue and I've managed to put the hours in and have a lot of fun doing so, but I can't help but wonder if the controls were just a touch more refined and a little less floaty, it might be that much more enjoyable. Stuffed is a fun little game that I can't believe has gone under my radar so well, but I'm glad to have found it. For the price, it's less than 20 quid, it's a fun little distraction that's enjoyable even if it's just a quick 20 minute play or a proper sit down, cup of tea on the side, elbows resting on your knees, hardcore gaming sesh. If you can play with others, it's sure to be even better, but as a single player experience, it's far from bad and I'd love to see more in the future, just you know, with Play Anywhere capabilities. Please, I'm a single father and I'm cheap as fuck. And that is the end of this video. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it and found it useful. If you did, do us a solid and hit the like and subscribe buttons below and give the bell icon a tap so you're notified whenever we've got new stuff for you to watch. I've been Chris, you've been gorgeous, and I'll see you on the next one. Until then, cheers my dears.